Hey folks, decided to do a video today on some of my favourite 3D Blu-rays that I have in my collection. Um, I wasn't a big fan of going to the to the cinema to watch uh, 3D movies there. There was a big fad of it again a couple of years ago and everything was out in 3D. Um, but I, I always felt that the, the 3D image in the cinema was was too dark and I, I really didn't think it added, added much to the experience. But... Um, I bought a projector and a, a Blu-ray setup, and I have a, a hundred in screen here at home. And um, I must say that uh, I try. I bought uh, one one uh, Blu-ray on 3D to try it just to see what it looked like, and I was I was blown away by it. What the home theater experience is totally different to uh, what I experienced in the in the cinema. So I uh, I started collecting uh, a lot of uh, 3D Blu-rays, and um, I find them great. I find them totally immersive and it's a, it's a whole new experience to watch in the movie so i have uh, i have 10 blu-rays here that i think uh that anyone should have and everyone should have in their in in their collection um i'm not really big into pop out uh i find the that a bit gimmicky you know but it's 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 nice in in, in some in some movies but um it's a bit of fun but i i find the depth in in 3d movies totally uh, immerses you into the experience of the movie and uh, it's 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 really great. It's really great fun, um, especially uh, big blockbuster popcorn movies in three D. Um, myself and my young fella here, we we have a great collection of them. But um, I'll go into it. Um, I have ten of them here. They're not um, uh, ten to one, and one is the best. They're just ten three D Blu rays uh, that I think are stand out uh, for depth and a uh, few pop outs here and there, and there are great movies as well to boot. Um, so we'll start off, uh, the first one here I have is uh, a Marvel, we'll go through the Marvel ones here, it's um, Chaswick Bo Boseman, Black Panther, uh, great depth in this, really great, it, and, and it's a great movie and uh, it, you know, there's a few pop out moments in it, but uh, totally entertaining and the 3D in this guys is, is second to none, it really is, it's top drawer and it's a great experience to, to watch on Blu-ray. Um, on the biggest screen you can find. Uh, as I said, I have a hundred in screen here and it's 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 a marvelous experience to watch uh these movies. And it's uh, it's really sad that Chad Chadwick Boseman passed away and we won't get to see him as Black Panther again. But have this in your collection, uh definitely uh, Black Panther. So um okay next we have another Marvel movie. This is Top Drawer 3D guys. Doctor Strange really is really is cracking 3d cracking 3d in this and a good few pop-up moments in this as well there's a scene at the start uh with the buildings folding in on each other and it's just jaw-dropping 3d really adds to the experience of this movie especially uh, it's made for 3d so um dr strange that's another one and next we have one of my favorite marvel movies it really is and it's funny and it's got fantastic 3D in it. Thor Ragnarok. Really, really great movie. Fun movie. Uh, 3D in this. The depth of feel in this, guys, is brilliant. It totally immerses you in the, the whole 3D experience. Uh, and the effects in this, as with all the Marvel movies, are top drawer. But definitely have this in your collection. Uh, it's, it's a great movie. It's one of my favourite uh, Marvel movies. I uh, go back to it time and time again. And to watch it in 3D is just great. So that's Thor Ragnarok. Um, next up we have a movie I feel is, is probably one of the most underrated films. And didn't really do that well when it came out. Um, uh, to Tom Cruise, Emily Blunt. Uh, Live, Die, Repeat. Uh, Edge of Tomorrow I think it was called in the States. Over in Europe it was changed to Live, Die, Repeat. Um don't know why i think the edge of tomorrow is a better title for it but uh yeah tom Cru cruise and emily blunt the 3d in this is brilliant it really adds to the experience of this movie uh it's just out of this world um tom cruise is great in this emily blunt and it's a great movie it's a fun movie very underrated picture uh and i really advise you to have this in in, in your collection if you're collecting any 3d uh blu-rays so uh, that's Emily Blunt, Tom Cruise, Live, Die, Repeat, Top Drawer 3D. Okay, next, 
Uh, great movie here. And the 3D in this is brilliant. That's Matt Damon, The Martian. Very good movie. Really, really good movie. And I really enjoyed the 3D in this. It really added to the experience uh, of the movie. Uh, and it's 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 really... There's no real pop-outs in this. It's just all about depth, as I said. And um, Matt Damon is great in this. And it's a very entertaining movie. And a nice one to have in your collection if you're collecting 3Ds. So that's The Martian. Uh, next up, we have The, per uh, the Prodigious T.S. Spivet. Pick this up. This is a foreign uh, import. So it's in, in, I think it's in Spanish. But it's The Prodigious T.S. Spivet. This is a really... It really, really surprised me this movie. Um, it's a real, uh, it's it's an offbeat, off the ball movie. It's a melancholy movie, um, and it the performance in this are top drawer. Um, it's the the three D in this. I'm not joking you. Is just spectacular, uh, and I would advise anyone if they're collecting three D to pick this up. Um, I found I found it hard to track down. Actually, I got it on uh, Amazon. I think it was Spain. Uh, the prodigious T.S. Pivot. It really, really is jaw jaw dropping 3D, and uh, a must for any 3D enthusiast. So um, pick this up if you can. As I said, I had to import this. It's a few extra quid, but well worth it. Really well worth it. Okay, that's that one. Uh, next we have. I'm dropping things all over the place here. Next we have a great movie really underrated film we have dread really great movie carl urban really brilliant performance is dread and a very very underrated movie i don't know if this did that well when it came out in theaters but it is absolutely brilliant and the 3d in this the depth in this is great uh, a must again for any collection in 3d uh, so that's carl urban dread brilliant movie and great 3D. Okay, moving on. We have Mad Max Fury Road. What can I say about this? Again, action packed from start to finish. A cracking movie. Really is. It really is. There's pop out in this, there's depth in this. This has got everything. It's 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 top drawer 3D, very entertaining movie. Uh it, it really is from start to finish. Uh, action packed and a must for your collection uh, so pick this one up if you can I got this second hand on, on CEX I think I paid a tenner for it it is absolutely worth every penny uh, it's just brilliant 3D and a must for any collection Mad Max Fury Road okay now moving on to the last two here I have and uh, these are old movies um, from the 1950s uh, there was a massive craze of 3D back in the 50s. And uh, I was delighted to pick these two movies up here. The first one being, I think it's 1953. I, I might be wrong about the date. And I think it is, yeah, 1953. Uh, Rhonda Fleming. Uh, classic movie, Inferno. And this is brilliant 3D in this. I mean, for a movie this old, the 3D is just unbelievable. And it really adds to the experience of watching this movie. And it's a very good and it's a very entertaining movie. And Rhonda Fleming looks absolutely stunning in this. A uh, beautiful lady. And she really, really looks great in 3D. Uh, and it's a good good movie, as I said. Very entertaining. Uh, an old classic from the 50s. Inferno. A must for your collection if you're a 3D enthusiast. Okay, the last one I have here is, is the classic Alfred Hitchcock uh, Dial M for Murder uh, in 3D this really really adds to the experience of watching this movie uh, this movie takes place basically in, 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 in one room for the whole well 90% of the, the film is in the one room and it really adds to the, the, the it opens up the space of the room uh, and it really adds to the movie experience and the depth of feel in this is just absolutely fantastic uh, so that's Dial M for Murder in 3D. A definite 3D pickup for any 3D enthusiast. Uh, really enjoyed it. Fantastic movie. Ray Milland is top notch in this movie. And Grace Kelly looks absolutely stunning in this. What a beautiful, 
lady she was and she just looks fantastic in this and the production and and direction by alfred hitchcock here is second to none it's a very entertaining movie uh from the 50s and great to look back on those movies again and especially uh 3d uh which was a massive craze back in the 50s and for the for, for the transfer onto the blu-ray here is it's just brilliant it looks great so that's dial in for murder so there's 10 of uh my collection of 3d movies i have a lot more there and uh but they're possibly uh the best that i have uh, and i really enjoy it so um thanks for watching and uh please uh if you can subscribe to the channel uh slap a like on the video i really would appreciate it uh for future content i'll be doing more reviews unboxings uh of uh, movies coming out movies on netflix uh all things movies so um mccord movies please subscribe to the channel i really would appreciate it and uh we'll talk soon thanks again for watching take care